Hey everybody, Billy from Billy's Bike Adventures. Thanks for tuning in today and watching the video. It's the beginning of June 2021, bank holiday long weekend, and I've decided to take a trip to Wales to do a few days touring around Wales and taking in ABR's 10 highest roads in Wales. Just going to ride through Wales's version of Winnet's Pass right now. Doesn't compare really, but good enough. No need to wave, I'm already coming past fella. Look at this U-bend in the road ahead, beautiful. If this was a one-way road that was empty, imagine how much fun you could have on this, but gotta be respectful of other cars, not take the risks, but just beautiful. So I just had a cyclist fall over right in front of me. Fortunately, I wasn't too close to him and I was able to swerve out the way. He caught his foot in one of these potholes on the left, or his wheel, sorry. And uh, unfortunately, went down like a sack of spuds. He looked okay though, so I didn't stop. He, had a, he was riding with a mate, so I didn't stop. But uh, good reminder of how vulnerable cyclists are out on these types of roads. I highly recommend you try and get out to Wales and do ABR's Super 10 or 10 highest roads in Wales. There's a link in the description for you to be able to download the GPX file for the route that I'm doing today and tomorrow. So uh, download it, plan a date in the diary and get it done. You won't be disappointed. So clean up here, man. Oh, this is lovely. Look at this, though. Brilliant. Now, whilst this is good fun and you tend to see parts of the countryside that uh, you might not ordinarily have seen, and you've got to do 200 miles in a day. This type of riding does not make for good progress. 
So it's a little bit frustrating that I'm averaging, what, 20 miles an hour at the moment? If I'm lucky, these lanes are very thin and you just can't take the risks. Fastest I've been. Oh, hello, little fella. Go on, keep going. Go on, mate. Go on. Go on. Go on, mate. Go on. Go on. Good lad. Good lad. You made it. This is very slow going and not the type of riding that I would like to do. I mean, some of it's okay, but um, I've been in this now for quite a while. Reminds me of being in Cornwall, trying to get around Cornwall in a camper van in Devon. Well, I'm more Cornwall than Devon, but pretty much this is what you get. And in a camper van, it's not fun. But I'm out of my bike, I'm riding, could be worse. Could be piddling down with rain. Now, little did I know, this is what was waiting for me when I got out of that enclosed single track road. This is Gospel Pass in Wales, part of ABR's Super 10, or the highest 10 highest roads in Wales. Highly recommend that you take the time to do that. Keep watching, some spectacular views coming up. Look at that, just take it in for a minute. Wow. Beautiful. Tony Wales was nice. Okay, so that was worth it. That crappy lane was worth it, so I would highly recommend it for that, because that was really nice. Very windy up here, as you would expect. Top of the hill in the middle of nowhere. Look at the views, amazing. 
just beautiful. But watch out for the dollies, the lambs, the sheep, but otherwise, spectacular. Pretty darn nice. Okay, so that was worth it. Highly recommend it.